Hello everyone. My name is Regis. Hi, I'm Eva. And we are the founder of a company called AHA. We created that company in 2015. And at the time we had a dream. We envisioned that everyone on the planet had access to healthy, great food. Healthy food the body needs, full of vitamins, fiber, minerals, good for the heart, good for the brain. We dream our world had a, a food manufacturing capability efficient enough so everyone could enjoy healthy food without pesticides. So we embark on a mission to give a tool to people, to feed people, to manufacture such food. Since no such equipment was available, we simply created it. There's been a lot of failures in aquaponic projects. So it was important to engineer equipment that makes aquaponics easy. So everyone can enjoy it. Everyone can build a facility in their place using fit for purpose equipment. It's like our mobile phone, it's complex inside, but anyone can use it with a finger. Aquaponics is a, a natural process. It's an ecosystem. We simply feed the fish, the plants grow using the fish waste, and clean the water for the fish. No harmful pesticide can be physically used, otherwise the ecosystem is destroyed. Our body also gets destroyed when we eat such pesticide, slowly but surely. Typical aquaponics requires fish tanks, biotreatment section, and deep water grow bed, as you can see at the back here. Separate section in commercial units, and in the domestic kits, we combine all three in one system, all connected. It can be built anywhere, on the 13th floor of a building, rooftop, garden, next to a pool, balcony, it can be decorative. No need for transportation from the countryside. We manufacture the food where it's consumed. We can eat fresh food, harvested daily. The backbone of all AHA system is the MIT, the Modular Infinity Tank. It can be assembled and disassembled very easily in no time. It's a Lego style assembly. Installation does not require any hand tools. Two people can assemble 100 MIT in one day. So it's very quick and easy to build systems anywhere. It's also versatile. We can have it at 45 centimeters on the ground to grow coal plants, for example. We can have it at 90 centimeters if we put this one on legs. We can have MITs on top of an MIT, like this, to grow twice as much in the same area available. It's also more than a tank. It's been designed for optimum plant growth. We are now selling the fifth generation of MIT. It took six years to develop it, and it's ready for you. To grow plants in the MIT, we use different systems. One of them is the floating raft. Those are these blue boards that uh, hold the plants, hold the pot, and the plants' roots grow in the water, the plants grow on top of it. This is perfect for plants like lettuce. So we developed also this very strong floating rafts. They last for years. And they are perfect for net pots where any media can be used. This is a pot that we have developed as well. They are designed, optimized for these rafts and also for the nurseries. Inside this pot, we can grow anything. Our flagship, beautiful tomato, cucumbers, berries, lettuce, kale, cabbage, anything you want can be grown in this pot using any media on this strong raft in deep water system.
The floating rafts are great for plants like lettuce, but some plants need a strong mechanical support. Cooking herbs, for example. So for these plants, we developed another system called the AHA tray, and it's based on wicking effect. The bottom of the tray is inside the water, and by capillarity, the water climbs up the media. The plant gets both oxygen and nutrients from the water. We also tested and optimized the media we use in these trays. We can combine trays and rafts in one MIT. They are the same size. So in these trays, we grow, for example, rosemary, thyme, basil, parsley, sauge, as you can see here, celery, and they grow amazingly well. In the MIT, we not only grow lettuce, tomatoes, but we can also grow bigger plants. Like this finger lime tree, for example, we put in a system five months ago, we already start to have some fruits. Right now, we're doing also some experiments on medicinal cannabis. This uh, plant has been put in a system only three months ago. Judge by yourself on the size. In one month's time, we'll harvest it and we'll do some analysis on the product itself, on the quality of the product itself and CBD content. 